Well, greetings and salutations. Made it back out to Reedley Beach. It's kind of an icky day today. Um, the weather's bad. As you can see, the sky looks terrible. So, hit possible thunderstorms. So, hopefully, I don't get hit by lightning or something crazy. But anyway, I'm gonna try to get out here where I left off a couple weeks ago. See if I can hit some targets. If it starts raining or thundering and lightning, I'm gonna go underneath the restrooms over there. We got some ugly clouds. I hope them things are going the opposite direction of me. That's a 1920. That's pretty good. Let's see what that is. That looks like Looks like I got it. Oh, it's like one of those ace bandage things. That you hold your ace bandage with. Oh, first find of the day. I guess you could technically use that. It was a good solid signal. Yeah, I didn't realize this was a high bank and then a lower bank. First bottle cap. This time it's a Coca-Cola. Yeah, I think I'm gonna hit this low, low bank. Because normally this right here, I think, is all underwater and people wade in this stuff. That's a five. Let's see what that is. So it's in the bat scoop. It is a piece of foil. It looks pretty fresh too, actually. It's not all nasty looking. Usually those super low numbers are foil. The only two gold things I got came out as a, a 10 and an eight. This is a place I nicknamed Bottle Cap Beach. Saying it's shallow, so let me just see if I could swipe it. Yep, bottle cap. I see it. Right there, nice shiny gold one. It's weird. The bottle caps will give you like crazy, crazy numbers. There's a bunch of itty bitty fish in here. It's a 50, 48, shallow. I bet it's a bottle cap. Let's see. Here at Bottle Cap Beach. Let's see what it is. Oh, it's a lid. It's a Coke can lid. Yep. Or beer can, I'm not sure. But see how sharp and jagged that is? And we are literally right in this little beach area. Look at that, it's crazy. People, put it in the trash can. That's a 38. It's staying at 38. Staying, so it might be a, more of a pure metal. Oh, I see it. It's a bottle cap. It is our wonderful Corona Extra. Pretty sure that was all that's in there, but let's we'll see. We'll hit it again. Yep. That one wasn't all crazy. It's a solid 38. Somebody's digging out here. 17. 
15. I like the numbers. I mean, it's not varying much. Now it's going crazy. It's not even picking up. Maybe it's in here. Maybe there's multiple targets. Yeah. So whatever I was after. Yep, it's a bottle cap. Right there. Another Corona Extra. All right. Those are good numbers. Right on the edge here, it's a nine to 11. That's kind of like what my gold ring came up at the coast as. Says it's in the scoop. Let's see. Do we have treasure? Do we hear clink clink? There's something and it's all rusted up. I don't know. Oh, it's like a hair clip. I think it's part of a hair clip. It has some shiny on it. Boy, it was giving good numbers though. Might be another part to it right here. Yeah. That's the other part of it. There's that rope swing. That's another 8 to 13. And if I'm finding that hair jewelry, I'm probably in a decent spot here. Because you don't know what else you might find. Let's see if we can hear some clanky sounds. Big bad nothing. It fell through the cracks. <laughs> I'm gonna try to see what this is because it's whatever it is is small. But this is like the third one. And I have yet to find out what they are. That's in my hand. Ah, uh, fishing weights. I bet that's what the other ones are too. They're small enough and they're round that they're falling, they're falling through my scoop and they're where I can't see what they are. And they're solid lead, so they're giving me pretty decent numbers. Oh man, those clouds look nasty. I don't know if I, can you see what's coming? That is ugly. Eholy. I want that over there versus that. I think that dark cloud's coming our way. So I need to be mindful of that. Okay. I think that is right. Yep, bottle cap. I gotta pick up the pace here. There's a big piece of glass I'm gonna pick up. Cause I don't think of that bad boy. Ouch. Oh man, 
that it's ugly sky. It's got me a little nervous, as you can tell. And that's gonna be another can. Yep, look at that. I'm gonna pick that one up because it's all jaggedy. The other ones I'm gonna let. Somebody, I mean, they're everywhere. They're just laying on top of the ground. So somebody can come recycle these, but this sharp stuff, I don't want somebody to step on it. I don't have a giant garbage bag to pick all the trash up. I'll pick the glass and the nails and stuff like that. I'm gonna head to the bathrooms because that's what I'm dealing with. Those ugly clouds and it's raining right now. So I'm gonna go chill. I'll work my way back just in case. Find something amazing. Oh yeah, I hear the thunder. That was a 15, but I got to go. I'm gonna turn this machine off. I'm carrying a dang stainless steel on a pole basket. I'm like a lightning rod. Sky looks great over there, but it's, it's, it's raining right now in the water. I can see it sprinkling, and I think, I think I got some ugly coming. Yeah, I can hear some thunder. All I got is this little lip to sit under. I don't know if I really want to chill here or walk to the car. There's another little river beach area I would like to go check out. It's uh, it's in Layton. I'm not 100% sure I'm allowed to hunt there. I was gonna find out prior. But I think I'll just sit out the storm and try to decide what to do here. But I think that thing's going to take a couple hours to blow over. It's not even here yet. But it's coming. Oh yeah, that's definitely thunder. It was nice to get back out to Reedley Beach. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to hunt very long due to the bad weather. I wish I had my camera rolling as I drove through the storm. It got pretty crazy. Rain, hail, high winds. Fortunately, I made it home safely. I hope you liked the video. And if you did, please hit the like button. And don't forget to subscribe. And as always, I hope you have a blessed day.